Here's your WNEM-TV5 news update. Good morning, everyone. I'm Blake Heller. Here's a look at the top stories we're following today. A man is facing charges after a school threat in Alma last month. The threat, September 22nd, led to three students being placed in juvenile detention. It also led to the search of an Alma residence where officers seized multiple firearms and ammunition. Tuesday, Gresham County prosecutors announced the arraignment of 45-year-old Corey Wolsey. He's charged with felon in possession of a firearm and ammunition. His association with the detained students was not revealed. A judge has dismissed charges against seven people in the Flint water crisis scandal. Among the people cleared by the ruling, former Flint emergency managers Gerald Ambrose and Darnell Early. The decision does not affect former Governor Rick Snyder, whose case is being handled in a different court. Prosecutors say they will review Tuesday's ruling and stand by their commitment to exhaust all available legal options in this case. And the state secured a legal victory in the fight against the owners of the Edenville Dam. The U.S. District Court established several facts in the lawsuit coming from the May 2020 dam failure that drained Wixom Lake. In doing so, it exposed a, quote, misleading and false narrative crafted by the defendants to blame the failure on the state. Tuesday's decision creates a legal foundation to hold Boyce Hydro accountable for what the state says was years of neglect of the Edenville Dam. All right, here's John checking out your forecast for today. Thank you very much, Blake. Yeah, not too bad of a day coming your way. We do have another day of some mild temperatures, and I think this is going to be the warmest day we are going to have for the rest of the week. Low to mid 70s looking good. We will add some more clouds to our forecast by the afternoon. We'll call it partly to at times mostly cloudy. Southwest breeze will keep you right about 5 to 10 miles per hour into tonight. Not as cold as nights previous we've seen this week. I think some upper 40s near 50 looking good as we do go into your Thursday morning. Let's talk about the next seven. That's going to be the next best chance for some showers into tomorrow afternoon and into the evening is going to be the better time frame there. Temperatures starting warm, but we're going to be falling in the numbers throughout the day tomorrow and barely making it to 50 if we're lucky on Friday, but at least your weekend that's going to be looking mainly dry and we do warm up a little bit more into next week. Some sunshine returns Saturday, Sunday numbers back near 60 as we go into next week and the first one five weather center. I'm meteorologist John Gross. Remember to tune into WNEM TV 5 on air and online 24 7 for the latest news, weather, and information.